Hey everybody, I hope you're doing well. Today I'm going to do a Dutch pour. I haven't done one in a while and they're kind of fun to do. They're kind of fast. But I had somebody in my Facebook group that was asking how could they do a Dutch pour? How did, how did it work? And so I thought, you know, it's just, I wrote it out to her, but I thought, you know, it's just as easy to demonstrate it as it is to tell somebody how to do it. So that's what I'm going to do today. So I'm using Deco Art, Titanium White, and Lamp Black, and one Metallic Gold, which is the 24 karat gold. And this is the um, Americana De De Decor Metallics. So <clears throat> it's a beautiful, beautiful metallic gold. My ratio is one to one with Floetrol. I don't have to add water to it with the black and white for sure. We're going to see on the gold because sometimes the metallics are a little thicker. So you do have to add some water sometimes. This is a three ounce bathroom cup. I've probably got about two and a half ounces of paint and Floetrol together. This is a 12 inch canvas. It is thicker and I am going to add some water. My water has a bit of Floetrol in it. You don't have to measure it exactly. I would say about 10% Floetrol to 90% water, but you don't have to measure it exactly. It doesn't, it's not going to make that big of a difference. It just helps your water blend in better with your paint mixture. But always put your paint and flow trial together first and then add your water at the end if you need it. So that feels a little bit better. I dribbled here, so I'm just going to wipe that down. Again, that was added with flow trial, latex based. And everybody loves this Deco Art 24 karat gold. It is fantastic. So I've got in my really dirty bottles here, I have white already in my bottles, same mixture, 50-50, uh, no water added. You don't need to add water. Is put a puddle of black right here in the corner. Pour on a healthy amount of gold. Maybe a little bit more black. And then circle around it with the white. So we're going to blow towards the corner first a little bit. We'll add some more white just in case. And then we're going to blow back this way. And pop any air bubbles before we get started here. So this does not have silicone or OGX in it. It's strictly paint and Floetrol.
I'm going to add a little bit more black down here and gold. I think I like this pretty well. I'm sure some people would have said just leave it alone a lot earlier. But sometimes it's just fun to keep playing. This was fun to do. I really like want to do some more just with this color combination. So I may have to do another one. So there it is. So I hope you enjoyed it and if you did please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel please. I need all the subscribers I can get to keep these videos coming. If you are a subscriber, click on the bell in the bottom right to get notifications when I post new videos. Check out all the links below my video where it says show more on your laptop and the down arrow on your mobile device. There's my Thinkific platform where I have some online tutorials how to paint acrylics with brushes. And my Facebook group if you want to come join me there. My Amazon recommendations link. My PayPal link if you'd like to contribute anything. I, the donations are always appreciated. And a big shout out to all those that continue to send donations once in a blue moon. It really does help with the supplies because it is very expensive. Pouring is a fabulous habit, but it can cost a lot of money. So I will see you on the next video. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.